Calendar Budget Premium is here, which automatically connects to your bank account and it works fantastically, except for a rare condition where sometimes it will say that your bank account uh, does not appear to match things until some date about three months ago. What's happening here is when we first connect your bank account, sometimes Calendar Budget doesn't receive the correct information from your bank to set the original balance of when the reconciling started. So what I mean is we, for example, in this case, when we look back to February 28th, we never had the correct initial balance. And so that is causing this problem where the days are mismatched and these account balances are all wrong. It's an easy fix, thankfully. What you wanna do is just, if you've been keeping your bank account up to date, um, then you can just scroll back a few weeks to maybe three weeks ago and use a balance from three weeks ago that you know is correct. If you don't have a balance that is correct in calendar budget itself, then just go to your bank uh, statement and log into your actual bank and just look for a balance from about three weeks ago that definitely won't have any pending transactions in it and use that. In this case, I'm just gonna use this balance from about three weeks ago. And what you want to do is click this gear icon at the top right corner of the reconciling tab. And beside the account that you're working on, click the button that says update pairing. And here what we wanna do is just make sure that we are adding the balance on that date. So in my case, this is April the 18th, so I'm gonna just select April the 18th, and I'll enter the balance as it's specified here, 238.91. And as soon as you save that, assuming that the balance that you saved was correct, then all of that messaging disappears and suddenly it's up to date with reality. You should only need to make this change once since Calendar Budget will kind of make a rolling forward balance update. But um, that initial balance, sometimes we just don't receive that piece of data from your bank correctly. So making this change should resolve the problem. And if you have any other questions, feel free to reach out to us at support.